The Bangor Humane Society is launching a new fundraiser today that combines animals and the arts. The goal is to help support the shelter virtually since other ways of raising money have been a big challenge during the pandemic. New Center Maine's Chloe Thibault joins us this morning with details about the poorly drawn pet portraits fundraiser. Sounds interesting, Chloe. <laughs> Hi, Sharon. Good morning. You know, yeah, this is the first time the Bangor Humane Society has put on a fundraiser like this. All people need to take part is access to Facebook, a $20 donation, and a furry friend. So starting today, you can visit the Bangor Humane Society's Facebook page and click there to make a donation. After, you can write a comment that you donated and include a picture of your pet. Those pictures will be distributed to around 100 volunteer artists who will have up to two weeks to make make a portrait of your pet. These are some examples of pet portraits. Organizers say this fundraiser is all about taking a risk and having fun. The volunteer artists come from many different backgrounds, so you may end up with a masterpiece or just a funny memory. It's an exciting new way for volunteers to support a cause they care about. I think that during COVID, we are all kind of stuck at home and for me, as a volunteer and as one of their artists um, is, is going to be fun. The Bangor Humane Society serves five counties and brings in between two to 3,000 animals every year. The shelter is hoping to raise $10,000 to help with care, like heating the building, providing animals with blankets, food and vaccines, and making sure animals are spayed or neutered. It's just really uh, important that, that we do our best by them to try to find them homes. We've gone to all this trouble over the last, you know, several thousand years to domesticate them. And we have a responsibility to, to make sure that they're safe and warm and cared for. And this fundraiser got us thinking about how New Center Maine's team would do drawing our pets. So here are a few examples. We had some fun with that. The big fundraiser for the Bangor Humane Society is usually the Paws on Parade. The shelter says it's still waiting to see whether that will be possible this year, depending on the pandemic. Live in studio this morning, Chloe Tebow, New Center Maine.